Hello everybody, how you doing today? My name is Nick and welcome to my channel, a place to watch and talk about movies. And this reaction is another episode of Friends. It's going to be episodes 13, 14, and 15. And once again, I'm joined by It's Totally Cody. Hey everybody, how you doing? And I should just mention, this week has been a little bit interesting for Cody and I. We both have a, we both have had a little bit of uh, health problems. So for me, I am still a little bit sick actually. I have a little bit of a sore throat. Hopefully, it should not make too much of a difference. But just in case I'm coughing sometimes or anything like that, just realize I am, I'm a little bit sick, but I am still like pretty much back to normal so i feel like i'm able to like actually watch stuff again but i'm very excited to check out these next couple episodes wasn't the last video the one we did where uh ross found out the the baby's um that, 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 that's that what i was, was waiting for you to say yeah yeah, yeah. i mm -hmm. was like i was pretty sure that was the last video but yeah that was a pretty big moment like i said in that video i was really glad that ross handled it well and that it didn't ruin him and rachel's friendship because that was the only thing I was actually concerned about. And for those of you that do watch my channel and you remember on Big Bang Theory when Raj did that with Howard and Bernadette, it w it completely went the opposite direction in that one. So I was like holding my breath. I'm like, please don't do that. <laughs> I was hoping Cody was going to mention the other moment that for me was probably the biggest moment so far in this show. Paulo and Rachel finally breaking up. I yes. was so... I mean... It's, it's sad in a way because, like, you know, you don't want everyone to break up. But, like, just considering how much I've grown to love Ross and, like, Rachel together, like, I know it's a little bit unhealthy probably for this early in the show to, like, want them together so bad. But I really do. <laughs> it's like, just the fact they broke up and it opens the door for Ross, I'm just, I'm so excited to see where that goes. The only reason I, you know, we don't want people to break up in shows and everything like that. But the yeah. fact that Paolo really was, like, hitting on Phoebe and everything like that, like, I was like, I don't care about his feelings. Kick him out. Like, just like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, honestly, I mean, that, that was actually really great. The way Phoebe also told Rachel about that. I did not expect Rachel to be like that kind of okay with how Phoebe was telling her. I thought she would get a little bit more mad. I'm happy she didn't. It just shows like how kind of connected this friend group is, but I, I'm just, I'm so excited to see what happens next, but let's just hop right into it. Friends season one, episode 13, 14 and 15. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. She's. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, no, you wait. This is ridiculous. Can I just say one thing? What? What? That's a relatively open weave, and I can still see your nippular area. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, story about your patient who thinks things are like other things, you know? Oh, she's still with that scientist. Oh, that might be a new guy. Really well, sweetie. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now go away so we can talk about you. <laughs> Isn't he great? He's so cute, and he seems to like you so much. Sweet. Oh, it's so complicated. You know. And no, I thought that was the. Isn't that the guy that she was dating? Oh no, he no, left. No, remember he was leaving. Yeah, he, he, left. he left. That's right. Yeah. You guys want anything else? Oh yes. Could I have one of those? No, I'm sorry, we're all out of those. Anybody else? <laughs> <laughs> no, she's still upset because I saw her boobies. <laughs> Oh my God! Did he just, just say that? He put it out there. What were you doing, seeing her boobies? Not like I was across the street with a telescope and a box of donuts. <laughs> <laughs> Change the subject, please. Yeah, because hello, these are not her boobies. These are her breasts. <laughs> you know, I don't know why you're so embarrassed. They were very nice boobies. That, that's it. I mean, mittens are nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, rock. Hard place. Me. <laughs> <laughs> It's really funny. Uh, I wouldn't want to be there when, when the laughter stops. What do you mean by that? Maybe you have intimacy issues. Oh, or God. You use your humor as a way of keeping people at a distance. My God, he's he just like came for this. him. You're just mad. <laughs> I just met you. I don't know you from Adam. Yeah. Right, exactly. That's the point. <laughs> Parents divorced before you hit puberty. Huh? How did you know that? <laughs> it's textbook. <laughs> hey, you guys. Hey, you. you all know my dad. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, it's his dad. Oh, this is my friend, Roger. Hi. Hey, hey, good to meet you, Roger. What happened to the uh, puppet guy? Excuse me. <laughs> so, Ross, uh, how's the wife? <laughs> uh... Oh, my God. How long has this spy been oh, gone? He's been, yeah. Uh, Chandler, yeah, quick, say something time. funny. <laughs> <laughs> he's, like, I can... he's like, I'm walking on eggshells. We're not doing it right now. Uh, yeah. Uh, miss you, too. I love you. Oh, hey, mom. That's not his mom. Excuse me? <laughs> oh, he's oh, cheating. Oh, no. You know this isn't ma. <laughs> <laughs> the face, though. The face he made. <laughs> yeah, he's so guilty. <laughs> Her name's Ronnie Tishy. So 
Well, how long you been? Remember when you were a little kid? I used to take you to the Navy Yard and show you the. Do not tell me it's been that long. No, it's only been six years. That's long. I just wanted to put a nice memory in your head so you'd know that I wasn't always such a terrible guy. That is that is horrible though. Six years. You ever been in love? You're burning your tomatoes. Huh. You'll want to talk. <laughs> Dad's in love big time. And the worst part of it is, it's with two different women. Please tell me one of them is Ma. Oh, of course, of course, one of them's Ma. What's the matter with you? I mean, how would you know? <laughs> how would you know? <laughs> I think Joey's Italian because literally making your own tomato sauce and everything. Double life. He's like actually some spy working for the CIA. That'd be cool. <laughs> This blows. Parents just stay parents, you know? Why do they have to become people? Why do they have... Oh, stop, stop. What is Chandler staring at right now? Staring at my breasts. I mean, yeah. What? Because <laughs> he saw them. <laughs> Did you not get a good enough look the other day? All right, all right. <laughs> We're all adults. Since you saw her boobies, I think uh, you're going to have to show her your pee-pee. <laughs> I thought he was going with you should just show I thought he was, I thought he was going to say she had to show everybody. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't see that happening. <laughs> Come on, he's right. Tit for tat. Oh, she wants to see it. Phoebe and Raj. Oh, good. Raj is here. Yeah. What's the matter with Raj? Yeah. That's nothing. It's a little thing. I, I hate that guy. <laughs> oh, because, yeah. Analytical. Yeah. That's what he does, you know? Um, come on, he's not that bad. You see, that's where you're wrong. Why would I marry her if I thought on any level that, that she was a lesbian? Here we go. This guy's getting involved in stuff that has nothing to do with him. You wanted your marriage to fail. You don't want to say that. <laughs> he's like, you go get him. <laughs> Why? 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 I don't know. Maybe... Maybe low self-esteem. It's conceivable that you wanted to sabotage your marriage so that the sibling would feel like less of a failure in the eyes of the parents. No, <laughs> that, that was not it. He was not thinking about that when he divorced her. Guilty for her failures. <laughs> oh my God, Roger's gonna get his ass kicked. So you think I'm a failure, isn't he good? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> isn't he good? <laughs> You know what I mean? All these years, I thought you were on my side, but maybe what you were doing was sucking up to mom and dad so they'd keep liking you better. Hey, oh. I married a lesbian to make you look good. <laughs> <laughs> he used his logic. <laughs> this is terrible. On the Weebles cruise ship? Oh, which, which had this little lifeboat for the Weebles to wobble in? We're gonna catch that movie. We gotta get going. Yes. Okay. Okay. Bees, we're gonna be late. He literally just picked them all apart, and now they're gonna go watch a movie. <laughs> Come on, uh, easy on those cookies, okay? Remember, they're just food. They're not love. <laughs> you oh my God! <laughs> say that to her. Hate that guy. Mm. Oh look, it's the woman we ordered. <laughs> yeah, who's this? Oh my God, you're so much cuter than your pictures. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm Ron. He really told her about him. I I relate with Joey on a personal level with this. <laughs> uh, Joey's having an embolism. Yeah, I'm wondering how I'm wondering how this is gonna go for me. <laughs> like, Joey, if I go first, I want to be looking for my keys. <laughs> hey, Joe. Hey, Dad, Ronnie's here. What are you doing here? Oh, uh. Well, you left your good hair at my apartment. I figured you'd need it tomorrow. Thank you. Uh... <laughs> so, who's up for a big game of Kerplunk? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Make her leave. I, uh, I, I shouldn't have come. <laughs> yeah. I, I better get going. I don't want to miss the last train. No, no, honey. I, I don't want you taking that thing to swing this. Oh, where am I going to stay? Here? Whoa. No. <laughs> yeah, the hell you are. You can stay we'll in the hallway. The yeah. Yeah, no, you, you both can go to a hotel. That's fine. Unless he wants to, okay. <laughs> if he wants to, that's fine. Doing stuff. I want you right here where I can keep an eye on you. I mean, he's gonna do it anyway. You're though. gonna keep an eye on us. That's right, mister. And I don't care how old you are. As long as you're <laughs> under my roof, you're gonna live by my rule. There you go. <laughs> there you go, Joey. No sleeping with your girlfriend. Wow. He's strict. 
<laughs> You'll be in my room. Come on, I'll, I'll show you to my room. Sounds so weird when it's not followed by no thanks, it's late. <laughs> now, this is just for tonight. Starting tomorrow, you got to make a change. Six years is long enough. What kind of change? Well, either you break it off with Ronnie. I can't do that. Then you got to come clean with Ma. Now, go to my room. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, though, like he needs uh, to make a decision here because that's a long yeah. time. What the hell? <laughs> hey, Kiki. He can't sleep. He's just going to be thinking about them all night. Just trying to get comfortable. I can't sleep in my underwear. Well, you're gonna. <laughs> I've been thinking, you know, about how I'm always seeing girls on top of girls. End to end or tall like pancakes? <laughs> You know what I mean about how I'm always going out with all these women. I'll be able to be a stand-up guy and go the distance, you know? You're not him. You're you. When they were all over you to go into your father's pipe-fitting business, did you cave? No. No. You decided to go into the out-of-work actor business. <laughs> now, that wasn't easy, but you did it. You will have the courage and the guts to say, no thanks, I'm married. You really think so? Yeah, I really do. Thanks, Chandler. Get off. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. May I help you? Uh, yeah, uh, Joey said I could use your shower since uh, Chandler's in Oz. Okay. Who are you? <laughs> Literally. <laughs> That's so weird. Uh -huh. The mistress? Hi, I'm Rachel. Hi. The bathroom's up there. Right. Hey, listen, Ronnie, how long would you say Chandler's been in the shower? Oh, like uh, five minutes? Oh, oh God, oh. Rachel. <laughs> See, don't. what happened with him was accidental, though. Like, you don't want to... It's pee-pee time. Oh, my God! <laughs> Who says that? It's time to see your thing. That's J It's Joey. There's no way it's Chandler. <laughs> yeah! It's Joey! <laughs> We're supposed to be in there so I could see your thing! <laughs> Sorry, my, my thing was in there with me. Now we're just creating an awkward situation between the friends group. Roger's having a dinner thing oh, and he sweet. wanted me to invite you guys. It's Roger. We don't like him. Um, I don't know. There's something about... <clears throat> Basically, we just feel that he's... Oh, uh, on, just say we it. hate that guy. Uh, there you go, Rachel. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Sorry. Uh-huh, okay. So perceptive that it freaked you out? No, it's that he doesn't know how to mind his own business. Ma, what are you doing here? Oh. I came to give you this. Why did you have to fill your father's head with all that garbage about making things right? He knows. Things Wait, were what? fine the way they were. Of course I knew. What do you think? Your father is no James Bond. You should have heard some of his cover <laughs> stories. I'm sleeping over at my accountants. I mean, what is that? Who says that? Please. So then, how could you, I mean, how could you? Do you remember how your father used to be? I mean, it's nice. He has a hobby. He has a hobby. That's an interesting way Ma, to put it. I don't mean to be disrespectful, but what's what the hell are you talking about? Yeah. Literally, like, like, what's happening here? I'm so here? shocked. Hey, I'm fine. In an ideal world, There'd be no her, and your father would look like Sting. Ever since that poodle stuffer came along, he's been more loving. I mean, I guess. It's just, it's so wrong. It's based on a lie. Like, I'm not okay with that. <laughs> because now everything's screwed up. I just did what I thought you'd want. <laughs> I know you did, Cookie. You're ten times prettier than she is. That's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Could I take her? <laughs> this ring, no contest. <laughs> What's wrong, sweetie? Nothing, nothing. Oh God, she got to break up oh. with him right here. No, no, she she's gonna tell him no one else likes him. It's, I mean, it's nothing. I'm fine. It's just, um, it's my friends. They they have a liking problem with you. Oh, they don't. But you know. I'm shocked he doesn't like notice. He must really think he's being okay. No, they don't see all the, all the good stuff and all the sweet it's stuff. It's like Sheldon. I'm not at all surprised they feel that way. You're not, see, that's why you're so great. It's quite, you know, typical behavior when you have this kind of dysfunctional group dynamic. No, you're just stupid oh, and you no. need to stop talking to people about things. Please tell me you're not gonna make Phoebe like not be friends with them. With your stupid 
big cups. Here which we go. I'm sorry, might as well have <laughs> nipples on them. <laughs> Find me, love me, I need love. <laughs> oh, she's double. So you talk to your dad, huh? <laughs> yeah, he's gonna keep cheating on my mom like she wanted. My mom's gonna keep pretending she doesn't know, even though she does. Things sure have changed here on Walton's Mountain. <laughs> so, Joe, are you okay? Yeah. I guess it's gotta let them make their own mistakes. <laughs> He's got a point there. In a couple of years, we get to turn into them. I'll end up like my mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, except I broke up with Roger. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. He's a good person. In some ways, I think he is so right for me. It's just. Every other hate way. that guy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, she legit went to everyone else. She actually hate him. <laughs> that was... I mean, she ba he basically insulted her there the last time they talked. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tracks for the Booby Payback Express. Next oh, stop, no. Rachel Green. It's going to be Monica. Oh, no, it's Monica. Ah! <laughs> Joey, what the hell are you doing? Sorry, wrong booby. <laughs> wrong booby. <laughs> There's so much wrong here. What in the world oh is going my. on? They're just gonna keep peeking on everyone, I swear. And now it's Chandler, isn't it? Yeah, she, she gets to see Chandler. Hello, Joey. Oh! oh! Hello, dear. Chandler always like, hello, dear. <laughs> he was okay with it. <laughs> oh, that was that a was... lot of hair. <laughs> <laughs> Tell her Ross she wants you. <laughs> hey, Ross. Hey. Come on, Ross, you gotta get back in the game here, okay? The Rachel thing's not oh happening, my. your ex-wife's a lesbian. I don't think we need a third. <laughs> uh, excuse me, go up to her and say, here's your egg back, I'm returning your egg. <laughs> go with the egg, my friend. <laughs> think it'll work? No way, it's suicide, yeah. the man's got an egg. <laughs> Roger wants to take her out tomorrow. Roger? No, you just broke up with him. Hey, dump the guy? Seems creepy. <laughs> Still, it's nice to have a date on Valentine's oh, Day. Oh, because it's, oh, Valentine's, it's Day. Valentine's Day. Hey, guy, any night of the year. I know I do. Well, what are you guys doing tomorrow night? Actually, tomorrow night kind of depends on how tonight goes. Oh, out with me is because I said I could bring a friend for her friend. Yes, needy. She's vulnerable. I'm thinking, cha-ching. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna throw food at oh him. Oh my. <laughs> You're doing this. Hi. Hi. <clears throat> Come on, ask she Rachel. Yes. Oh, God. Yes. Way to go, man. Oh, he still has the egg in his <laughs> hand. <laughs> <laughs> now, by the end of the season, oh, her um, and Ross are I gonna be together. <laughs> I seriously hope so. <laughs> well, well. Look what you brought. Oh, did she like him Very more? nice. <laughs> and what did you bring? <laughs> <laughs> the way you said that, and what did you bring? <laughs> Cab smell off my hands. <laughs> Will you get me a white Simpsonzel and a glass of red for Janice? A red Janice? Janice. Janice? <laughs> oh. My. God. Oh, no. Chandler's face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's too funny. <laughs> he just can't catch a break. Okay, I'm making a break for it. I'm <laughs> calm down. You set me up with a woman I've dumped twice in the last five months. Stop yelling. You're making me nervous, and I can't go when I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're right. I mean, me too. Yeah, I'm that same way. <laughs> what? Oh, we don't. Come on! Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> the hell is wrong with him? <laughs> I did not expect that. Weeper? Remember the guy uh, that used to cry every time we had sex? Oh my god. What cried? Was it good for you? <laughs> Howard the I win guy. I win! <laughs> I win! I didn't get to win once. How do we You know my friend Abby who shaves her head? No. She says that if you want to break the bad boyfriend cycle, you can do like a cleansing is voluntarily bald. <laughs> Yeah, we can um, we can burn the stuff they gave us. What the hell? We can chant and dance around naked, you know, with sticks. <laughs> what, like we're witches, like in the Salem witch trials? 
Burning's good. Burning's good. Yeah, I need stuff to burn. The two of them. I cut you out of all my pictures, so if you want, I have a bag with just your head. Because, you know, you could make little puppets out of them, and you could use them in your theater of cruelty. We might be leaving now. Uh-oh. Uh, he wants to slather my body with stuff and then lick it off. Okay, you cannot do this to me. I mean, can't you leave? Three chocolate mousses to go, please. It's on me. I'm sorry, Chandler. I hope she throws up on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a crappy night. Your shirt's been sticking out of your zipper ever since you came back from the bathroom. <laughs> okay, yeah. <I'll... laughs> oh, that laugh. <laughs> she sounded like a goat. Oh, my. Why are you doing it in front of them? <laughs> Why are you doing it right there? <laughs> so... Another drink? Some dessert? A big screen TV? <laughs> I will go for that drink. You got it. Good woman? That's a man. <laughs> That's a man. <laughs> His face. <laughs> we get a bottle of your most overpriced champagne and a uh, Rob Roy. Maybe they are good for each other. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she no. slept together. Oh, no. Valentine's Day. <laughs> I feel bad for him. Like, he was drunk, I get it, but, like, now you're screwed. Because, like, you you can't really just... Oh, that feels so bad to do that to her, though. Can you believe this happened? And the thing no, is, though, she's no. going to get hurt again. <laughs> oh, Chandler, sorry. Oh, Chandler, sorry. <laughs> Rage, go on! Janice, hi! Janice is going to go away now. <laughs> This is, this is Joey's <laughs> fault. He left them alone. Honestly. This is so much fun. This is like a reunion in the hall. <laughs> Hello, Ross. Yes, that's right. It's me. How did you know? <laughs> when a dog flies from New York to Los Angeles, he doesn't just lose three hours. He loses like a week and a half. <laughs> Oh, oh, get the hell out. That's his ass wife to the... Oh, no! Why? And the woman touching her is her close personal friend. <laughs> <laughs> and say the, say the rest of it now, Ross. Tell her about how she's having your kid. <laughs> Anything else yep. you should know? Nope, nope, that, that's it. Nope. Oh, you gotta uh, tell about the... Yeah. Oh, and she's pregnant with my baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's pregnant with my baby. I always forget that. Part. Good job, Ross. <laughs> oh, that was perfect being dying by him. <laughs> oh. Okay. All right. Now we need the semen of a righteous man. Oh my God. No, you don't. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> Okay, Phoebes, you know what? If we had that, we wouldn't be doing the ritual in the first place. <laughs> and I have the uh, receipt for my dinner with no kululu. Mm, uh -uh. <laughs> Scotty Jared naked. Oh, let oh. me see. He's wearing a sweater. No. Ew! Yeah. Paolo's grappa. Wait, wait, Rachel, isn't it almost pure? <laughs> yeah, that's not a good idea. Hello, funny Valentine. <laughs> Hi, Just Janice. <laughs> But it's and I'm working with children, which is just... Aw, oh, she's not even paying attention. I can. I'm, can. I'm sorry. But actually, I'm spending most of my time teaching science. <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> <laughs> would, would it be too weird if I invited Carol over to join us? Because she's, she's, she's alone now and, and pregnant and, and sad. I guess. Are you sure? I mean, no, she's, she's, she's mad. mad. But, like, but, but, like, I mean, it's kind of a nice gesture in a way. Just caring about his wife. Like, like they're not actually together anymore. Come on, you. you guys will scooch, hey. won't you? Carol, Kristen. Hey, dear. Um, oh, uh, Carol teaches sixth grade. Kristen does something. 
that funnily wasn't even her major. <laughs> At least he got that part. Oh my Ooh. god. Half charred picture of Wow, that guy's hairier than the chief. Valentine's <laughs> <laughs> our busiest night oh, of the geez. year. I brought you something. Is it loaded? <laughs> Chan and Jan forever. <laughs> I had them made special. <laughs> Look, there's no way for me to tell you this. At least there's no new way for me to tell you this. <laughs> She's gonna stab him one of I these just times. don't think things are gonna work out. Seriously. I know that this isn't the end. <laughs> oh no, you see, actually it is. <laughs> <laughs> you love me, Chandler Bing. <laughs> oh no, I don't. <laughs> Soul calls out to me like a foghorn. Janice, Janice. I'm sorry, but no, <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. I mean, if they end up at the end of the series together. I will be seriously so shocked. Like there is no way. See. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, she has a slight point. However, <laughs> I don't think that's what's going Call on. Call me. See. <laughs> Wolverine. Oh, oh my god, she left. You did so. I swear I swear to how long has she been in the bathroom? I don't think she's in the bathroom. Her coat is gone. Yeah, she left. Well maybe yeah. it's cold in there. Oh, smile. They won't all be like this. Some women might even stay through dinner. That wasn't her fault though. That was literally Ross's fault. Yeah. Well, I, I'm sitting here with this cute woman and 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 she's perfectly nice, you know, and but that there's that's it's not it. Rachel. And, um, and then I'm here talking to you, and, and it's easy, and it's fun. What say you and I give it another shot? <laughs> yeah, okay. Rob. No, 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 I know what you're going to say. You're a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, let's, what do you say we just put that aside for now, you know? <laughs> Let, let's just stick a pin in Ross, it, okay? no. Because don't, don't do we're this. great don't together. Don't do this, Ross. You know, you can't deny it. Ross. No, see, you, you, you know, you, you keep saying that, but there's something right here. I love you. So you need to hold, you need to let go of this. No! Oh, no, but she's, ex I thought she was going to decline it. Oh, I love you too. But. No, but, no, but. It's time to take the pin out. Well, the right woman is just waiting for you. It's easy for you to say you found one already. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. All you need is a woman who likes men, and you'll be set. Well, we get off around midnight. <laughs> Why don't we pick you up then? Okay, okay great. <laughs> I think I'm doing fine fine so, um, what the, uh, oh, oh my God! <laughs> See, there you go. Oh, the cleansing worked. <laughs> nice guy. Oh, they're fireman guy. <laughs> you guys tell them you're married. No way. Oh. You're kidding. My girlfriend doesn't know. I'm not gonna tell them. Oh my God. Oh, that is wrong. I swear, the amount of people just cheating on each other, like, <laughs> it's like everyone. Let's see. A nice hot cider from Monica. Aww. It looks like you got this one right, at least. Uh, Rach, yeah? Aww. Why does my cinnamon stick have a razor? <laughs> Why is there a pencil in there? <laughs> she put the cinnamon stick in her ear. <laughs> oh, <laughs> don't <Sorry>. oh. <laughs> Headlock, you're looking lovely today. May I say that is a very flattering sleeve length on you? <laughs> Mr. Kostelik would like you to stop by his office at the end of the day. If this is about those prank memos, I had nothing to do with them, really. Nothing at all, <laughs> really. Chandler's coming, and he says he has, like, this incredible news. Act like, you know... Hey! Hey! Okay. Hey. Never mind, but it was gonna be really good. <laughs> he wants to make me processing supervisor. Oh, nice. That is... Hey. Oh, congratulations. So... I why? Wait, why? 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 This was supposed to be a temp job. Yeah, Chandler, you've been there for five years. Yeah, how temporary are you gonna get? <laughs> I just don't want to be one of those guys that's in his office until 12 o'clock at night oh. worrying about the weenus. What? The weenus? 
weekly estimated Again, net use of systems. Again, that's not what I thought you were saying. Okay. I have something you can do. I have this new massage client, Steve, opening up a restaurant, and he's looking for a head chef. Oh, wait, does he cook? Um, hi there. <laughs> Literally, like Monica as a chef. Oh yeah, no, I know you're a chef. I know, and I thought of you first, but um, Chandler's the one who needs a job. No, 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 no. It's about who can do the job. I just don't have a lot of chefing experience, <laughs> unless it's an all toast restaurant. He's looking for someone who can, you know, create the entire Come on, menu. That's Monica. Oh my god! Yeah, I know. <laughs> so what do you think? Phoebe, read the room. <laughs> Thanks, Phoebe. I just don't really see. Oh, Monica, guess what? <laughs> Can you see my nipples through this shirt? <laughs> no. I have an appointment to see Dr. Robert Pillman, career counselor, a go-go. You guys all know what you want to do. Goals, you have dreams. I don't have a dream. Uh, the lesser known, I don't have a dream speech. <laughs> <laughs> Even you laughed at that. Oh, my life, a Brian song. <laughs> He showed me where the restaurant's gonna be. It's, it's it's this cute little place on 10th Street. It's not too big, it's not too small, it's just nice. right. Was it formerly owned by a blonde woman and some bears? <laughs> 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 I really want you to be here, which would be great for me, because then you can ooh and ah and make yummy noises. What are you gonna make? Yummy noises. No, not you. <laughs> oh, you should make, you make that thing, you know, with the stuff. That thing with the stuff, okay. You know that thing with the, with the stuff? Yeah, I get it, Phoebe. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> that could be anything. It could be a pizza. Uh, it could be a lasagna. I know. Unlimited options. Uh, how about Tony's? If you can finish a 32-ounce steak, it's free. Okay. <clears throat> hey, does anyone know a good place if you're not dating a... <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this the bug lady? No, no, I love you, Ron. <laughs> so what are you guys going to do? Well, I just thought we'd go out to dinner and then introduce her to my monkey. <laughs> You thinking maybe, uh -huh. <clears throat> Well, I don't know. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> oh my God! Don't, don't scream, see? It's, it's not gonna hurt you. Soothing tones, <laughs> Celia. <laughs> Soothing <laughs> tones. Okay. He's got his claws on my. Uh, yeah. All right. <laughs> oh my God! The monkey was hanging from her hair. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he will not leave. Is it better than the other salmon mousse? It's creamier. Yeah. I'm just happy I'm keeping it down, you know? <laughs> God. Eight and a half hours of aptitude tests, intelligence tests, oh, personality so tests, and what do I learn? You were ideally suited for a career in data processing for a large multinational corporation. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally the job he just quit. Leave it. Don't I seem like somebody who should be doing something really cool? Something. Chandler, I know. You can't see your nipples through this shirt. <laughs> I had a grape about five hours ago, so I better split this with you. <laughs> it's supposed to be that small. It's a pre-appetizer. The French call it an amuse-bouche. Well, it, it is amuse <laughs> Yeah, 8 o'clock. What, what do we say, $10 an hour? $10 an hour for what? Oh, I asked one of the waitresses at work if she'd oh, help me out. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Of but I thought of you, but, but, I don't think you could do the job. But, but, <laughs> I, really I was going to say, do we really want to be honest with her? Uh, <laughs> this night has to go just perfect, you know, and, and, well, Wendy's more of a perfectionist, professional yep. waitress. Sort of been maintaining my amateur status so that I can waitress in the Olympics. <laughs> I mean, Rachel, Rachel, you can't take it that bad. Like, you know how many drinks you messed up. Rated tables at Innsbruck in 76. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be a woman soon. Oh my god. Weird thing happened to me on the train this morning. No, 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 no. Talk, say something. I don't think that's why. Oh. That's not what Ross does. What? He's a romantic, ooh. not a. <laughs> oh, ooh. Ooh. What? What? What the hell did he just say? <laughs> oh, that was, so, that was one of the funniest moments, I think, in the show for me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but it, it wasn't a total loss. I mean, uh, we ended up cuddling. You just say what you want to do to do to you. Or what you think other people might be doing to each other. <laughs> Joey. Try something no. on me. Please be kidding. <laughs>
Yeah, you don't want to talk dirty to him. <laughs> like, I don't, uh, I don't think Ross could do it. Uh, okay, I'm, uh, I'm in my apartment. <laughs> yeah, what else? That's it, I'm in my apartment, you're not there, we're not having this conversation. <laughs> All right, look, I'll start, okay? Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on. All right, ready, look. You get me so hot, I want your lips on me Jesus. <laughs> well, if you can't talk dirty to me, how are you going to talk dirty to her? Now tell me you want to caress my butt. <laughs> Please say that. <laughs> oh, my. Okay, turn around. What the? I just don't want you staring at me when I'm doing this. Okay, I, I want to feel your just so awkward. hot, soft <laughs> skin with my lips. Jesus. <laughs> I want to take my tongue and... <laughs> Say it! Run it all over your body and kill you. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, now they notice. <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> Funny story. You're not gonna believe it. It's okay. It's okay. I was always rooting for you two kids to get together. <laughs> Hello. And again. Hey, Mr. Kostelik, how's life on the fifteenth floor? This isn't about the money, you know. It's just I need something that's more than a job. I need something I really care about. And that's on top of the year end bonus. <laughs> Minute. No. No, no, stop saying no, stop saying numbers. I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. You've got the wrong guy. I'll see you Monday. There you go. <laughs> wow, it's, a it's big huge. It's so much bigger than the cubicle. Oh. With a beautiful view of... Oh, look, that guy's peeing. <laughs> <laughs> Helen, could you come in here for a moment? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Helen. That'll be all. <laughs> Wendy, we had a deal. Yeah, you promised. Uh-oh. Now she needs to ask Rachel. I like Rachel, but I just really don't want her to screw Wendy that up Bale. for her. I, yeah. I have no waitress. Ten dollars an hour. I could, but I've made plans to walk around. <laughs> you know, Rachel, when you ran out of your wedding, I was there for you. I put a roof over your head. Okay, you can't gaslight her you. now. Twenty dollars an hour. Done. Yes, may I take your coat? Oh. Oh, that's it. Hi, Steve. Hello. Mm, everything smells so delicious. <laughs> you know, I can't remember a time I smelled such a delicious combination of. of okay, smells. <laughs> that's a lovely apartment. Oh. I, I was just being polite, but all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. <laughs> this guy's gonna be hard to please. I in the cab on the way over, Steve blazed up a doobie. <laughs> Smoked a joint, you know, lit a bone, yeah. need hemp, ganja. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah Cheech, okay. <laughs> and a cilantro ponzu sauce with just a touch of minced. <laughs> Ginger. Well, smack my ass and call me Judy. <laughs> I think he liked it. <laughs> yep. Oh, gosh. I'm so glad you like them. Like them? I could eat a hundred of them. In about um, eight and a half minutes, we'll be serving some delicious onion tartlets. Tartlets? <laughs> Tart. <laughs> no, <I'm> so I. <laughs> you know, I don't know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Why is this me when I'm high? I love this. Uh... This is... <laughs> Yeah. Hey, sugar -o. Yep, there it goes. If you just wait another six and a half minutes. Oh, macaroni and cheese. We gotta make this. <laughs> How high is this guy? I thought it was gonna be No, we don't. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Give me the gummy bears. I, no. <laughs> 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 All right, well, shit. No. Give me the bears. Well, then you can't no. have any. Give them to me. No. It's not worth it. Oh, oh, oh. Bears overboard. They're, they're drowning.
<laughs> no. Hey, dinner is over. What? That's a lot. What? Why? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> work for a guy like that. Mm. I know, it's just... He was just I, like... You know, it. Look, you'll get there. You're an amazing chef. So, uh, how'd it go with Celia? Oh, uh, I was unbelievable. Beans, a motif. At, at one point, they were villagers. <laughs> at one point, they were villagers. Cuddle. Yeah, which was nice. Okay. Trying to catch a late movie or something? Yes, friend. Oh, I know what going. time it is, but I'm looking at the weenus, and I'm not happy. <laughs> because I care about it. You got it? Good. Whoa. <laughs> does that does this hurt? No. How about this? <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, buddy, so that's the end of Cody and I watching Friends, episode 13, 14, 15. I will say, I, I love these bunch of episodes. I don't think they were as good as the previous three for me. I, I think funnier, but just overall, like, I would say just based on the plot and everything, I, I love these episodes, but not as much as the previous three. But, Cody, what did you think about them? I gotta say, the one that I liked the most was, I think it was the first one with Joey um, and his dad. Or was that the second one? Um, no, no, that, that was the first one. So I liked that one a lot because I can relate to it. But I think the last one, I mean, I would have liked for it to go differently for Monica because it seemed like her dream is to own a restaurant one day. And I thought this would be like her kind of foot in the door. But I got to say, <laughs> that guy just going crazy while being high. Like I said in the reaction, I don't know if a lot of people that know this, that watch my channel, but I, I do take edibles for sleep. And that is legit what I act like <laughs> when I'm high. So, like, it was the funniest thing to just watch somebody else do it. Oh. Like, it was pretty good. But I do agree that the last the last three were the better ones. I, I will I will agree with Cody, though, on that episode. Because actually, I, I think we were in the exact same boat. Where Monica, <laughs> I really wanted her to get that job. Because it just felt like a good job for her. And, like, I get he was high. I just wish they kind of... I don't, I don't know. I wish they showed it in, like, more than one instance. Because what I got from it is that, like... He was just really high that night. <laughs> but, like, if he does not do it, like, all the time or anything, why would that impact her getting the job? So I just not get that completely. But, I mean, I, I mean, at the end of the day, it, may, it makes sense. And that's, like, not the job for her. I just wish they showed more of, like, you know, her reasoning behind that. Or maybe, like, her talking about why she did not want the job and him being, like, just completely high all the time or something like that. <laughs> that would have made a little bit more sense to me. But the episode before, I will just say... I, I do want to just point out, like, Cody and I probably had a little bit of a disagreement there because from my point of view, I thought Ross was being, like, just nice to his wife when uh, he had the Valentine's Day date with the uh, other girl. And Cody was like, no, 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 <laughs> like, don't, don't have them sit together. And I was like, no, 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 I want them to sit together because I thought it was just, like, as a friendly thing. But then when Ross kind of revealed his feelings, I was like, oh, no, Cody, you're kind of right. But in the beginning, I thought it was really innocent. But I was, um, I was a little bit thrown off by that. I thought he would have been, like, Definitely not because you're a lesbian, but that not seemed to, I guess, make it, like, not happen for him, <laughs> if that makes sense. But, I don't know, that, that was a very interesting episode for me. Well, I think that the, the reason why I said don't have her come over is because he was on a date with a new girl, and I didn't, I thought that she would feel uncomfortable with it. Um, and that's kind of, you know, it's just one of those, one of those, like, unspoken rules. Like, I know Ross was just trying to be nice and everything in the beginning there, but I feel like for the date, it would be a bad taste in her mouth, especially after he didn't even pay attention to her job. Yeah, yeah. And what she was saying. I, I, I will so. say that, that that's when it got bad. It's because what I thought he was going to like talk to them both equally, if that makes sense. I know that's probably unrealistic. I just, I don't know. I did not expect him to like completely ignore his date and just talk only to his wife. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. Right. But, yeah, I mean, it makes sense now why, you know, you would not want that. But overall, great bunch of episodes. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. And we will see you guys in the next episode of Friends, episodes 16, 17, and 18. So see you guys then.